is wind force. It is the force of moving wind. Wind force is helpful to us in many ways, but it can be destructive too. Wind force is helpful in flying kites, driving sailboats, flying parachutes, flying gliders, drying up clothes, and many more. Hurricane. Hurricane is an extreme windy condition where the wind force is too high that it can be very destructive. It can fly away houses, cars, and trees, even big heavy ships. It can become a reason for the sinking ships too. It can lead to a huge loss to property and life. Now let's learn next force. It's the force of moving water. Force of moving water can be used to sail boats. It's used for rafting. We are able to enjoy rides of water because of the force of moving water. Force of moving water is used in dams to produce electricity. Now, let's learn another force, and it is electrostatic force. Electrostatic force is the force of electrically charged objects. Take some small pieces of paper and a balloon filled with air. Now bring the balloon close to these papers. What do you see? These papers will stick to the balloon. This is electrostatic force between the papers and the balloon, which makes them stick to the balloon. Now take a comb and rub it on your head. Now bring it close to these papers. What do you see? The papers will stick to the comb, or you can also lift the papers with a comb. This is the electrostatic force between the papers and the comb that make the papers stick to the comb. So this force picked up papers without touching them. That is, this is an invisible force. So, this is also an example of non-contact force. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. And if you want to see more fun videos, you can hit that subscribe button. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram for more content. Bye-bye!